I've decided to start learning about Kabbalah, and it's blowing my mind. The more you learn, the more you don't know. Kabbalah, a mystical interpretation of the Torah that's thousands of years old. If you really want to get the depth of it, you're going to have to commit to your own intense spiritual journey. I'm open to more spirituality in my life, but nothing has really nourished my soul the way I had hoped. My unlikely path to Kabbalah began here, at a New York Rangers game. I started talking with a friend. He suggested I get in touch with a rabbi he knows. I view the study of Kabbalah before one is truly versed in at least the basics, the foundations of Judaism, as rushing to the dessert before one has even partaken of the main meal. This is all new to me, to our kids, to Miriam, especially the rituals. We feel a bit like visitors from another planet. See, the whole point of Kabbalah teaches you whatever comes your way, there's a reason for it. The real Kabbalists wouldn't even have like a non-Jewish person involved. Well, my father is Jewish and his name is Jesus. <laughs> How do you balance a normal life with a deeper spiritual commitment? I really think you gotta go to Israel. Makes me nervous, because we have a family, we're in this together, and I'm not really interested in becoming observant to find spirituality. I mean, I'd prefer he not be too extreme. Kabbalah is how to learn the language of the heart. The way to change that out there is to change this in here. First time I really prayed and connected. It took me 49 and a half years.